Stacy Burke here, and it's a Monday, so that means it's time for a grocery haul. It today I'm filming this on the 12th, 12/12/16. Just get done grocery shopping, and today's magic number is $132.53, and I used a coupon, a $13 off coupon, so it would have been more. But that's how much I spent. A little more than a bargain for, like always, because I didn't really think I needed that much. But yet, as you know, there's some staple things that just cost more money. So let's get down to it, because I kind of got a lot, but yet I don't. First things first, it was time to get the cat food. And I always get the urinary tract infection, because I have boy cats. Well, one girl cat, but um, this helps her urinary tract. So it doesn't get blocked because I've had cats that have fall ill from that. Boy cats are more susceptible to that. So I always make sure I get urinary care. Okay, let's get right in. Oh, might as well get into this because it's the only thing in there. I don't know why I got this. It's too close to Christmas. I, to me, it's like Christmas is almost halfway home. Along the way. This was $14.99, and I got a lot of sweaters. And it doesn't really feel that soft, but I just got it because it was the only small so it's an ugly Christmas sweater. It's the only small they had. $14.99. And as you know, I go to Kroger, AK Ralph's. So I might take that into work and shrink it. I'm going to wash it and shrink it because it's still kind of pretty big. So I'm going to probably take that in and wash it and shrink it. So that was the only thing in this bag. I think, yeah. What? Why is it so heavy? Oh, I got more coupons. <laughs> I think these are old. Yeah, these are old. Those away. <laughs> I keep them in my bags, you know, so, so in case I do decide to use them, but that's old. All right, we'll get into this bag first. As you know, sometimes I like my white wine, but I don't want to commit to a full box, so I get the little half box. This is like five bucks. So I got some Chardonnay. Plus, this weekend, I messed up. I thought the boat parade was this Saturday that already passed. No, it's this Saturday. It's the 17th. And so everyone just not really comes over here, but it's kind of like a block party. So what, you know, you need some snacks and some drinks on hand because you never know. I think we're going to make some hot apple cider and brandy and keep it on the stove. And then that way we can keep it warm, keep our hands warm as we go outside because I heard it's going to be cold this weekend and everything's going to be outside because we're going to watch the boat parades that go by our house. So that's why it's a block party because everyone comes out of their houses to look at the boats going by. Okay, there goes my phone. And I've been buying this like crazy because now that it's winter, all the doors are usually closed. So it just houses all that musty smell. And as soon as Christmas is over, I can't wait. I want to just gut the house and clean it because I've been saying that forever, right? But when you're taking down the decorations, I'm going to try to gut the house and clean it. But I've been using a lot of um, Lysol. <laughs> my, my phone's going crazy. Roy's been wanting healthy snacks. I don't know how healthy this is. Probably not. But I got him some veggie chips. <laughs> I think it doesn't really matter because potatoes are vegetable. I guess it's technically a root, but it's a vegetable, right? So it's basically potato chips. And I'm wearing antlers. And I'm wearing another Krampus shirt. But this Krampus shirt didn't turn out too good. Yeah, I have like three Krampus shirts. So now it's not the same shirt, different shirt. And yeah, still shorts. This is my new thing. I swear to God, it's just comfortable. It's just really comfortable. Leggings and shorts. Wow. Okay. Oh no. Everything's okay. <laughs> I think. We'll see. Something might be broken in there. I don't know. My phone's going off because it's hooked up to Twitter. So someone's on a Twitter rant. Um, I couldn't find any almond milk eggnog, but this is coconut holiday nog. So I'm going to see if Roy likes this, and I'll try it too. It's only, ooh, it's 90 calories. It's a little more calories than the, the hey, nope. A little more calories than the almond breeze. Nope. I got marshmallows. <laughs> I don't I don't know what I'm going to do with them. I might put them in my coffee. I might put them in my uh, apple cider. I don't know. Um, 
But I actually got them because I have a can of yams. I do like yams. And I do love to bake the yams with the marshmallows on top. So I bought them just in case I get an inkling to do that. All right, let's see what broke. If anything broke. I think everything's fine. Okay, as you know, I like candles. This is a new candle. Oh, it did break. Yeah, it did shatter. Oh, well. It should be fine. It's not like a... a it should be fine. But this is a new Shimmering uh, Wonder. It's a uh, plum blossom. It smells pretty good. Uh, it did kind of crack, but it's not that bad. It should be fine. It should be fine. So I, I got a candle. And I always buy three because I put two in the hallway. I have like, what do you call it? Sconces? Sconces? What do you call those those things? You put that candle and it, they're on the wall. <laughs> Anyway, I have a two of those in the hallway. And then, of course, I have a candle that I put in the living room. So I always buy three. So I got these shimmering wanders. Smells good. I don't know what happened to the other one. I think I bought three. These are stocking stuffers for Roy because he loves gummy bears. These are the real fruit juice gummy bears. Black Forest. All different kinds of flavors. Then he loves cola. So I got him fizzy cola gummy bears. And then I got him the regular cola gummy bears. He loves those. So those are going to be stocking stuffers for his Christmas stocking. Felix, he's playing with my Christmas sweater. Another thing, Roy um, wrapped some of our Christmas gifts. And I think he forgot that about animals because Felix likes to chew the ribbon. See, I wrap my gifts, most of them. But I don't put the rip, I don't put the bow on it until like two days before Christmas, or else my cat will chew up the bows. If you have cats, you probably know that. Um, and also, Clyde was chewing on one of the presents, and I told Roy, "Go be careful. If you have anything like food items or anything that you're gonna wrap, put them up because the animals will smell it and they'll start chewing on it." So, you know, it's holidays with the with the pets, right? All right, the next thing, now this is for the moment thing. This is pumpkin pie spice. It was on sale for $1.49. And this is iced coffee. Oh, my God. This is just iced coffee. This whole thing is iced coffee, pumpkin spice iced coffee. I went, oh, my God, I'll try that for $1.49. It's only, a, why not? I'll try it. And it's 150 calories for a glass. And so I don't have to make coffee. I could just, if I don't, if I'm running late, I just pour myself a glass of iced coffee. I thought this was brilliant. So I'm going to try that. Oh, I can't wait to try that. Yay. I could probably put brandy in it too. That could be good for like, ooh, that could be good. Okay, I got these, as you know, for um, my closet. And I got the pine stuff before. And I think I have one more pine left. But I like pine, don't get me wrong, but now I want to change it up. And this is holly berry. So I got these for the closet. So that goes in the closet. Okay. Oh, here's the other candle. There's the other candles. I just thought it was something different. Why not? Why not change up the scents, huh? Now, this is the, the lotion I use. I actually like lotions. It has A, vitamin A, vitamin C, and vitamin E in it. But it's really hard to find. But Jurgens luckily makes one with C, E, and B. They just don't have the A. But this is the, the lotion of choice that I use. And it's in a pump bottle. So I was out of lotion. So I needed to get me some more lotion. And I think that was like 7 bucks. That wasn't that bad. Then I have coffee that I bought last time that's in there. But I like to keep some on stock. I'll probably put this in the freezer out on the balcony. I don't know. I My grandmother would always put in the freezer to keep. But some people say it, it does work to keep it fresh, and some people say it doesn't. So I don't know. But I do keep it in the freezer. And then, um, like, I, like, I have the coffee in this freezer, but then I have a spare freezer in this, this, yeah. <laughs> Anytime I was raised with my grandmother, like, I stock up, like, because she was born, like, she was, like, raised, like, during the Depression. So I, I still have that. And I got to stop doing that because... We got so much stuff. I I overstock. I know that's a problem with me. Like I I will buy too much stuff. 
Because I feel like, well, I don't feel like, what if I don't feel like going to the store? What if I get sick? And what if, what if, what if, what if? You know, it doesn't matter. Now you have people that Uber it to you. You really don't need to. So I got to really stop. I got to stop. But I keep saying that, and I don't stop. Okay. More champagne for my mimosas. For my, 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 my mimosas every weekend. And then I was needing some more fabric softener. I just like the smell of it, especially when I did Roy's laundry today from his man cave. Oh, my God, because the house was smelling like, oh, I hate that phone. My house was smelling so gross. And I go, what does that smell? And I, I smelled his blankets in his man cave on his futon. Oh, my God, he smelled like a dead rat. So <laughs> I washed him twice, and I used some of this just to get off. Oh, it was terrible. I don't know what he did, but what did he do to make him smell so bad? And we need some more tall kitchen trash bags. So I got some trash bags. Okay. And, of course, Roy. Because as soon as I buy them, he eats them. I got him more Doritos. So there's his Doritos. And I tried these. These Remember a long time ago I bought these? These are, and eh, they're alright. The Chinese chicken place, they're okay. But they're open, so I've been kind of snacking on them. So I got those a long time ago. Now, I like peppermint bark for Christmas. But this had three different kinds. This has the peppermint bark, which I like. And the eggnog, Ghirardelli eggnog. These are chocolate wafers. And the other one's pumpkin spice and caramel. I don't know if I'd like that. I'll try it, but I don't know. Milk chocolate, pumpkin spice, and caramel. That just sounds like too much, too much. But this is my favorite. But this one looks really good. Eggnog. So I got one of I got these. I don't really eat that much candy, but it's nice to have just for the holidays because this stuff doesn't come around only once a year, you know? Yeah. Shredded carrots for the bird. And Clyde, he, whenever I feed the bird the carrots, Clyde always has to have some. He loves carrots. And as you know, I keep these on hand because I, I used one the other day. I think if you so follow, follow me on Snapchat, I put a bunch of diced tomatoes. I put some uh, Parmesan cheese. I put a lot of black olives. And I put fresh chopped broccoli. And I made myself a nice, fine, healthy pizza. So, if that makes sense. But... Yeah, I like to doctor them up. I like to buy just cheese pizza and doctor them up. And the romaine, for some reason, everything's expensive right now at the store because it's right before Christmas, so they know if people are going to buy. So I usually buy romaine lettuce for $1.99, but it was like 3 bucks. I'm like, oh, no. I'll just buy normal iceberg lettuce then. And, of course, it has romaine in it. It has romaine and iceberg and everything. This was $1.09, so I just got some lettuce. Lettuce to keep on hand. As you know, I always get broccoli for the bird and for us. And Roy gets his chicken. I used to always give him fried chicken, but now I get him rotisserie chicken. And this was on sale for $6, $5.99. So that was score. That was a score. Okay. Now here's my waters. I got two of them because Roy's been getting into my waters because he hasn't gone to the store and got his waters. Usually he goes to the store and get waters because he likes to get this big old huge flat thing of all those individual water bottles that are just too heavy for me to carry. And yeah, just too heavy for me to carry. Plus, I really don't, I'm trying to discourage myself from buying individual water bottles just to somehow save the planet a little bit. So I like to buy this one. That's Clyde drinking water right now. So I got two big water jugs. I needed some more cleanser. That's what I clean the house with is cleansers. I got cleanser. Clean the toilets with that and stuff. This is just regular eggnog. It looks like it's almond breeze, but it's not just normal eggnog. Yes. Can you tell we love eggnog? I love eggnog. Like I, I will every day after work, I fill this up with ice and eggnog. And you think, oh, that's not a lot, but it's pretty deep. Oh, yeah, it's, yeah, and I try to let the ice melt a little bit, but I can't help it myself. I start sipping on it, and it's gone. So, yes, I love eggnog. I love it, I love it, I love it. 
And then, like I said, I had to get some bows for the presents that I wrapped. But I haven't put them out yet because Felix likes to chew them. So I got these bows, and they're just like red, white, silver, and black. So I thought that'll go good for Roy. You know, manly bows. Manly bows. And of course, paper towels, select the size. Quite smelling. Oh, I'm going to get Maxine. Remember Maxine? She's coming. Um, her, uh, My friend Nancy's bringing her um, this Sunday coming up. Uh, so she's going to stay with us again. So I'm going to have a visitor. Clive's going to get a girlfriend again. Oh, popcorn balls. I got these. See, my grandmother I was raised with on my dad's side. She would always make popcorn balls for Christmas, and she'd make them red or green. And basically, it was carol syrup. Car carol syrup? Is that my saying it right? Carol syrup? You know, corn syrup. And with food coloring. And she would just make food, uh, popcorn balls. And, you know, it was just a, a treat. We'd always have cup. So I had to get, I don't know if they're going to be exactly like how she makes them. I have a feeling there's going to be kettle corn balls. But I just bought them for nostalgic reasons popcorn balls. My grandmother also would always love ribbon candy. Now, I don't get that far buying the ribbon candy. Oh, this shirt is so unflattering. You can tell it's just a guy's shirt. It's just boxy, unflattering shirt. Ugh. I think I'm going to change my clothes as soon as I as soon as I'm done with you, I'm changing my clothes because this shirt's uncomfortable. Okay, well, yeah. oh, I forgot to get I forgot to get flaming Cheetos. See, I always do this. I'm going to have to go to Rite Aid tomorrow. You never see me buy my flaming, flaming Hot Cheetos. You see me eat them, eating them on Snapchat because every morning that's what I eat. I eat the Flaming Hot Cheetos puffs dipped in sour cream. Oh, my God. I can't believe I forgot to get that. But like I say, it doesn't really matter. I just pick them up at Rite Aid. But I got the sour cream to go with them. So I had to get sour cream. And we have pepper but those containers for some reason it's hard to shake so this was on sale so I just got just normal black pepper because we use that a lot I use a lot of pepper and stuff I think this is just yeah these are all just the canned cat food for Frankie seven cans because seven days in a week that's why I get seven cans <laughs> uh, okay well, that is $132 and something cents. <laughs> so, yeah, I guess I got a lot, but not really. But, oh, well, I got a coupon. It would have been cost me $13 more if I didn't have that coupon. So, I'm going to put all this stuff away, change my clothes, feed the dog because he wants his lunch. And, uh, yeah, do that. So, to all my space cadets and all my briquettes, I hope you're having a groovy day. Until next time, peace.